A big question for OKC in this series is, will Steven Adams be a difference maker or will the Rockets play him off the court? I want to cheat and say both, but I have to choose one. So I'm going to say he's going to be an X factor, a difference maker. His work on the boards, I mean, that's a given. He's seven foot. They've got a center, 6'5". P.J. Tucker is 6'5". Adams is going to work them on the boards. And he's got post moves. He can score. We know Adams can score, and Tucker will have a hard time defending him. The big question is on the defensive end. And I do think that Donovan and Chris Paul will work up a scheme and they'll be disciplined. I don't know what that will be yet, but I feel like I can trust Adams to make it work. Okay, that's fair. I think, I mean, I think you're right that it's going to probably be a little bit of both. There are going to be some games where he's effective and some games where he's not so much. Um, I feel like on the whole, though, You know, it seems really obvious that, like, obviously we have a size advantage over the Rockets. They're playing small ball, and it seems just as simple as that. Like, obviously, Steven Adams is bigger. He'll get more offensive rebounds. But that hasn't been the case for other teams that are in a similar situation as the Thunder. So the the Rockets have been playing with the small ball lineup for a couple months. They've played the uh, the Nuggets. They've played other teams that have, you know, big true centers like Steven Adams. And – it hasn't been like as effective as you think it would be. So they found ways to work around the fact that they obviously don't have the size to match up with most teams. And so I just don't think it's that obvious of a difference. Um, I do think that like Adams will, you know, out offensive rebound other teams. He usually does that anyway, but where it comes into the problem is being able to guard three. So he has to cut play away from the basket to defend those three shots. And that's just not really something that's, a strong suit for Steven Adams. So I think they might actually play him off the court, unfortunately. Well, for the Thunder's sake, I hope for once I'm right and you're wrong because he's the Thunder's fourth and fifth best player and they absolutely need him to be a difference maker if they're going to win this series. For sure. 